To me, cage-busting leadership is not being constrained by the rules or regulations. A perfect example is when I first came to Washington, D.C. as the school's chancellor, we had lots of people working in the central office who didn't have the skills and knowledge necessary to be successful in their positions. Uh, at that time, we thought that we needed a big turnaround, and a lot of people said to me, well, there's nothing you can do about it. We have rules that say that because these fa people fall into a certain class of civil servants, uh, that you can't terminate them. So I went to the mayor at the time, Mayor Fenty, and I said, sir, you brought me in to do a difficult job, but the difficult job turns into an impossible job if I can't build a team that can be successful. And he looked at me and he said, well, if you don't like the rules of the game, then you have to change the rules. So he introduced legislation to the city council that allowed us to make all central office employees at-will employees. And that, to me, was a game changer.